Gonna do a dream. There's a couple more. There's a couple more. There's a couple more. Yeah, rarely. A couple more dreams. You do? Yeah. Not me. Oh, good. <laughs> That's song. Good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're in business. We're ready. Now you have to hold your breath while Belinda reads her dream. It's a very long one. So hold your breath while she. Go ahead. Play rendering. What? what is that? Play rendering. Play rendering? Plural? Mm. Renderings? No. Oh. oh. I like it. I love these kinds of dreams. Uh, yeah. That's the only thing she remembers. Oh, there it is. Play right? Well, I remember I heard it. Hold it. I heard it. I went back to sleep. I heard it again. Oh. Primo. Or I tried to go back to sleep, I should say. That's it. So, uh, <clears throat> English is not my first language, so I have a difficulty understanding English. Right. Uh, what is this word, rendering? Uh, I had to actually look it up. What? I had to look it up. Oh, you're looking, you too? Yes, I had to look it up. What did you find? That it means like a drama or a play. Oh. Or what was it? Yeah, that's what it was, right? No, an art. Sorry, it was art. It was a drama or an art. An art. It wasn't play. It was a drama or an art. Art. This word rendering means yeah. what? A, a drama. It could be a drama or an art. Or art. Or yeah, I looked it up. Let me look at that again. Oh, there it is. First one I looked at. A performance of a piece of music or drama. Message. Mm -hmm. uh, see, and it's right here, art. Mm -hmm. Visual art. A visual art, architectural drawing. Um, a liberal <laughs> rendering of <laughs> idiom. A performance, a performance. Yeah. Right. Yeah, okay. like some sort of performance. Okay. Now the big question, though, is: Does that fit with your sense that it's correct in terms of the dream? You see, the heck with the dictionary. Uh, see, I didn't know what it meant. I. <laughs> that's why. I had to look it up because yeah. I had no idea what it meant. So I, if, we, if we use this idea of performance, then what is it saying? Um, like what kind of performance am I playing out? I, that's what I was thinking probably. I wasn't sure. I, I thought it was important because I got woke up twice. Sure, sure. And you're saying, as you're considering it, it's my playing, it's my own playing out mm -hmm. is captured by play rendering. Yeah, like what am I playing out? What am I, what, is, what am I performing? What am I yeah. doing? Good, good, good. Now, could you tell us uh, what it was like? That is to say, what did this occurrence in the dream do to you? What effect did it have on you? Well, wait, a wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> go ahead. Okay. Um, when I first heard it, I go. I told myself, "Oh, I'll remember that. I'm going to go back to sleep. I'll, I'll write it down later." Right. So I try to go back to sleep again. Okay. Therefore, how would you describe it? Like, yeah, I'll remember that. Like it was no big deal. Thank you. I'll use that. No big deal. Go ahead. And then I tried to go back to sleep, and again, 
louder this time. Louder. Mm. And oh, and I go, okay. I guess I got to get up and write it down. Ah. Right, it was loud. Mm -hmm. Right, it was louder. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. What did that do to you? It made me get up and write it down. You better get up. <laughs> I got up out of bed and wrote it down. And what did you do? I wrote it down. Okay. Uh, again, what state of mind did that do? What did it do to you? Um, then I, uh, I obviously felt it was important um, that I was supposed to get up out of bed and write it down because it was very important that I do so or else I wasn't going to be able to go back to sleep. See, that's all good. Um, uh, I'm not familiar with those states of mind. Uh, so I'll ask you a question, okay? Say, um, we're now getting the description of what it was like to have that dream the second time. Mm -hmm. You saw it as important, mm -hmm. and you had to get up mm -hmm. and act, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Now, that's a state of mind. Mm -hmm. uh, when did you experience that similar state of mind? When did you have the dream? Oh, God, I have to look it up. Sorry. It's a while ago. Um, June 4th. Okay. See, normally I would ask what happened on the preceding day. All right, it's not mm -hmm. likely that you might remember what happened on the preceding day, mm -hmm. but you might be able to answer the question, where have you... Can you identify this having occurred in your life at some time yes. and describe what happened at that time when this took place? Yes. Go ahead. I've heard um, loud uh, voices before in my life. I've um, loud voices before in my life um, where I'm actually awake when I hear them. Um, one said, um, rise your lips. Do that again. Rise your lips. Do it again. Rise your lips. Rise your lips. Yes. That's very curious. And another one said, you are not alone. You're what? You are not alone. This is two separate yeah, occasions. Okay. You are two not separate occasions. Alone. Yes. Yeah. Raise what your lips. That do you? Same sort of feeling. Yeah. Um, like, um, what does it mean? Why am I hearing this? Uh, what's going on? Um, it's like, um, like a puzzle I'm supposed to figure out. But um, what it means? Uh, I don't know. Yes, you do. <laughs> Let's use what you said. What does this mean to you? Um, at that at that moment in my life, um, I was feeling that way, like I was alone. Like um, I know it sounds weird because I'm not alone, but yet that's how I was feeling. Mm -hmm. And this was telling me, like, um, no, you're not. You're not alone. And then raise your lips um, meant to me, um, I've had a, a really hard time like finding my voice, mm -hmm. speaking out, saying things. Um, I've been very introverted into myself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that told me that I needed to come out oh. and speak and uh, yeah. like show myself. Yeah, too. Yeah. Show yourself playing out, playing. Come mm -hmm. on, showing, show yourself. That's a performance. Oh. Right? <clears throat> hmm. What yeah. do you think of that? By that I mean, what do you think of your mind sending you this kind of message?
it seems like it's um it's helping it's helping me like something or some um myself is helping me or something higher than myself is helping me no, that's right 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 Mm. Right? Mm. That's the knowledge of the self coming out. Rather interesting, isn't it? Uh, do you have an interest in that? Uh, for a while, yeah. <laughs> right? I, I wrote a paper about the self. Um, I think you saw it. Um, right before, or close to when I started coming here for my philosophy class. Mm. And um, because I've had an interest in what, who I am, what's my purpose, what the self is, um, why am I here, Mm -hmm. um, is there any rhyme or reason to it. And um, so yeah, it all seems to go together. Hmm, interesting. So, waking up? Yes, I've been doing that a lot, waking up. Oh. <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> I woke up out of my dream. Hmm. All from two words. words. Okay, everybody, we probably have time for maybe one more dream before 10 o'clock here in Nazi Bar. I thought 10 30 was going to be. I talked with Mel. Oh, okay. All right. You can bring him tomorrow. We are meeting. All right. Okay. All set. Okay. <coughs> you don't know yet whether you're available to the UPR Saturday. Do you know yet whether you're available on Saturday? Do it again. Saturday's talk. Do you know oh, I have a medical at eleven fifteen, so I can only be here for an hour. At I don't Jesus mind being here an hour? an hour, but I have to leave at eleven. Okay, well, um, okay, I can send out a note about okay. that. Thanks, Pierre. Please, go right ahead. Um, Marie and I were in our room enjoying each other, each other's time, when I noticed looking out of our bedroom window that our grandson was outside walking very gingerly to a ball in the middle of the lawn. And two other kids were walking up to him and the ball like they wanted to play. So I told Marie, and she wanted to stop our enjoyment, but I didn't want to stop because I felt I could watch them and make sure they are okay, but she said no. And I forgot to add that, and this is, this is an embarrassing part, is that behind them was a busy street. Pardon me? Behind them was a busy street. I forgot to add that okay, in here. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> and that, that adds to yes. the reason why you wanted to observe. Yes. No, 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 no. Read it once more, okay? Mm-hmm. I'm going to read it again. Yeah, please. Marie and I... We're in our room, enjoying each other's time. When I noticed looking out our bedroom window that our grandson was outside walking very gingerly to a ball in the middle of the lawn, and two other kids were walking up to him and the ball like they wanted to play. So I told Marie, and she, she uh, wanted to stop our enjoyment. Uh, but I, wait a minute, she okay, wanted to stop the enjoyment? Yes.
Go ahead. Um, but I didn't want to stop because I felt I could watch them and make sure they are okay. <coughs> but she said no. Yeah, good, good, good. What am I going to ask? Uh, stay of mind? Yeah. At what point? Uh, the end. Um, I didn't like that. More. Um, I felt I could, I could do both at the same time. I felt that uh, it was very possible, and there was no problem. So what did you think when she said no? Uh, I was, I was like I understood, but. I feel I can handle it. Therefore, how does the dream end? <clears throat> it ends uh, with a failure, right? I don't know yet. <laughs> how does it end? Uh, it, it ends with uh, stopping our enjoyment. No, she said no. Yeah. It stopped it. No. No. Uh, what's the problem in the dream? Well, in the dream, she wasn't allowing me to uh, do both. Mm -hmm. She wasn't allowing me to enjoy her and also watch them to make sure they're okay. Yeah. Where's the problem then? Uh, well, the problem is, is uh, when she said no, that brought my state of mind down. Say more. Come on, keep going. Um, she, in the dream, she was uh, stopping me from uh, enjoying. No? Uh, See, <clears throat> you're silent. Yeah. What does that do? Right at that point, you're silent. Yeah. Silence is a danger. Why? Well, you, you don't get uh, the answers you need. You go along with what is being said. Yes. Yeah. So what is that like? Come on. I, I don't like that. Come on. <laughs> yeah. See, that's a state of mind. Mm -hmm. uh, I, it's like I'm not being heard or trusted. And what does that do to you? It brings me down. Yeah. But I understand, now that I'm out of the dream, I understand what, you know, yeah. What the yeah. problem is, but in the dream I thought I could handle it. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Look here. What does this feeling state do to you? Not being heard, not trusted, silence. What does that do? It brings out the bad in me. That, that's right. It turns off. Mm -hmm. Now, where did you learn that? By that I mean, this is something you learned. Mm -hmm. What am I going to ask you? Uh, to go back. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. When did you experience this as a kid? Um, I experienced it uh, hmm. Trying to pinpoint something. It's good. Glad to hear it. <laughs> I mean, is there something we didn't see? Or you didn't see about it? Always. Go ahead. How old were you? Well, that's what I'm trying to, to 
to get to there. Um, I remember it happening, but I just don't, I can't place it. That's okay. What happened? Can you recall any part of it? Uh, well, basically it's, it's like a, when you uh, want to express yourself and someone basically tells you to be quiet, um, that you're, uh, you're not meant to be, uh, you're meant to listen, not to be heard. Uh, kind of like feeling um, very imposing your will on on me yeah, yeah. and uh, not letting me have a voice yeah uh, ideally what should you have said at that time I should have said I can handle this I can handle this you should have said that too mm-hmm I can handle it yeah what does that do well, I'm able to express myself, but... No. Yeah. Right, that's right. <laughs> See, whatever, you, whatever is going on, whenever you're silent and don't respond and don't say what you really think is going on, then you walk away with their beliefs. Then, you, then this, you take what they're doing as true for yourself. Then yes. you don't trust yourself. That's true. Right. So yeah. therefore, what are you going to tell them? I'll speak my mind. Add more. I want to hear the word, what they're doing. Well, I say, trust me. That's it. And if you don't, finish it. Uh, if you don't... Then whose problem is it? Come on. <laughs> Whose problem would it be? Theirs, I guess. I guess? Theirs. <laughs> <laughs> the danger of silence. Eldar. Do that tomorrow? Thank you. Okay, giant. Let's call, uh, let's, can, well, can you be there tomorrow morning? Uh, yeah. Okay, can we finish? Yeah, we can do it tomorrow morning. Okay. Okay. Nancy's on her way. Okay.